I'm at Big Bend National Park, which is one of the most remote places in the United States. Yet for the entire trip, I was connected to killer internet with Starlink. I'm an aerospace engineer and here's how it works. Starlink is what's called a mesh network of satellites in low Earth orbit. They're all talking to each other via space lasers and ground terminals connected to terrestrial internet infrastructure. My little terminal talks to these satellites in real time, actually switching satellites every few minutes because of how fast they're whizzing around Earth. Now all satellite internet before like the last couple of years used to rely on these big satellites in what's called geo, geosynchronous orbit. This is 22,000 miles above Earth versus Starlink is just about 350. You've used some of these traditional telecom satellites if you've ever used in-flight Wi-Fi, which as we all know is kind of the opposite of reliable high speed, low latency, any of that. But because Starlink sits much closer to Earth, the signals can travel there and back much, much, much faster than to a geo satellite. So you get what they call low latency, which allows you to do things like FaceTime your friends after you get engaged on a hike in Big Bend. You also get faster speeds because the satellites are closer to Earth and because there are so many of them, Starlink can provide internet to pretty much anywhere in the world, even remote areas that don't have traditional internet. 